Hello and welcome to a GTA 5 mod showcase. Today is the Railroad Engineer mod or Train Simulator, Train Driver, whatever you want to call it, mod. Um, so basically all this mod allows you to do is drive trains, trams and it's something that GTA you can do as a center mission but it just doesn't allow you to do it in single player which is really annoying because I don't know it's just awesome driving train so this mod allows you to do it thanks to J10 to install this mod I'm gonna leave a link in the description all you want to do is download it and install the two files in your main GTA 5 folder and go into single player not online single player and just find a train like this go to the logo and hold F and there you go you're in the train. Alrighty, once you're in the train, you can do whatever views you like, such as first person, which is awesome, like just cool. Like, look at that. And you got the panels, everything. Alright, but now let's go back to third person. The train controls are very simple as they're the normal ones, such as S to brake. W to drive or accelerate, and um, you got E for the horn. You can hear it, and you have H for headlights. On top of the screen, you have the miles per hour or speed of the trains. And currently, I'm going 37 miles per hour and increasing. And on top of that, you have a bar, as you saw just before, went a little red and is going red now. This is a derail meter, or also known as when the hell the train is going to fly off. And this increases when you're kind of on a turn on the track, such as now. Ready? Watch. It will increase. There's a slight turn. Um, to stop this, all you want to do is brake a little and try and just keep it a bit of a slow pace. If you want to derail the train, all you want to do is hold X. As you can see, it's flying there, going up. Now I will show you what derailing does in 3, 2, 1, I'm sure. Basically, that's it, you just go off the track and bang. And that's pretty much it, you just derail. Alrighty, one last thing I want to show you about this train is that if you hold F to get back out, you get put on top. And this is where you can like do awesome things because the train keeps on rolling and say you want to shoot like an awesome movie just get a gun and just start shooting while the train keeps on moving. Sick. Just do whatever you want. Another cool thing about this train is once you've entered it and then climb back on top, say you accidentally fall off like so, the train will stop and you can get back on it, just like this. And I think it even comes back to you, yes it does, look at that. How cool is that? And you just climb back on, fucking jump, 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 jump it. You know what, oh, fine, fine, be like, be like that. Climb back on and keep on going. Another cool thing about this mod is you can drive trams. All you want to do is the same thing as before, get close to the front, hold F, and you're in. You also have third person view and first person view. Details aren't as quite as good as the train, but they still do. You've got the same thing at the top with the miles per hour, You've got the derailment thing, which you can also do by holding X, and then you have a white bar at the top also. And this is the doors. By just pressing G, you can open the doors. Which is just so cool for me. I don't know, I just find it awesome. I don't know, just the fact of being a train driver, it's just cool.
Alright guys, thanks for watching. If you did enjoy, please leave a like and subscribe. And peace out.